Welcome back to Realistic Fishing. I'm over here at the Blown Out Bridge. I don't fish very often in this location. It's a little bit out of the way. And I don't really ever catch anything here. I think because it's so highly pressured. But we're going to give it a try. We'll see if we can get a quick bass over here on a wacky rig. Let's try something else. We're gonna give up on the wacky rig worm. Try something smaller, maybe a Texas rig. Now we're going with a Texas rig worm. This is a robo worm. I see a lure package floating around out there in the water. 1 16th ounce Texas rig here. Let's see if we can find a fish with this. Well, I'm not getting anything over here at the blown out bridge. Time to go. All right, we're at another spot I rarely try because it's usually covered up with a lot of people, but I don't see anyone here now. Well, nothing here either. I just can't find any fish today at these highly pressured public spots. You can feel it, you can see it. I'm excited about Friday, June the 16th. I've got it here, it's official. That's right, Saul and USWO wrestling stars from the past and the present. We all gonna be together for Friday night right there at the Troubadour Theater, Music Valley Drive. Doors open seven, bell time is 8 p.m. You better call somebody, tell somebody. Hot Rod Biggs is gonna make an appearance. Hammer Jack, Norray Havoc, I'm telling you, Damian Wayne, my son, LT Falk. We are gonna have a night to remember fans. I hope to see you there. This is a mule jig head 1 16th ounce. So we're gonna get this tied on and we're gonna rig it through the body of the little worm. So I've got the little jig head tied on with a polymer knot. Now it's time for the mini wacky rig worm. Say that five times real fast. Yeah, check it out. It's about a three and a half inch stick worm. If I can't get a bite fishing it wacky, I can also fish it like a Ned rig. Let's see what this can do. No, I wasn't recording for it. Look at it, I just caught one on the wacky rig. You can see it in his mouth. Don't you hate it when that happens? All right, all loud with an airplane going by and everything going crazy. I wasn't even recording. I got this nice chunky little bass here on the wacky rig worm. 
the Ozark Trail Wacky Rig Worm. Let's get a quick picture. Well, I didn't get the hook set, but I did get a fish. Hey, confidence level up from a three to an eight. I think now we can catch some more since I broke the ice with this fish. No skunk, nice little bass here. Let's let them go. Yeah, let's make sure we're recording for the next one. Hey, at least I still have my rig, right? That's good, that's good. Usually when you get a bite on a wacky rig without the O-ring or a rubber band, he shakes it off, but that fish did not jump. That fish did not shake it off. Bummer that I missed the fight, but we're gonna get another one. Let's keep fishing. I'm Cousin Condry, and you're watching Realistic Fishing. Keep it realistic. We're going to try under these trees, then we're going to try the point. Fish. <gasps> Came off. Damn it, I had a fish. I guess I didn't have him hooked very well because after a few seconds he came off. Slow, slow night. I've been back and forth, up and down the bank. One fish tonight, that's it. I did have another solid bite, but he came off. That's a beaver. He's waiting for me to leave. He's waiting for me to leave so he can get back to chewing on his favorite tree right here. Fish. Fish number two. Hello. There we go. We got a nice little half pound bass here. Got him on the Ned Rigged Ozark Trail Stick Worm, just a little one. I think the worm's maybe three and a half inches. Second fish tonight on that worm. Let's get a picture with this one. Not sure how well you can see me, but here's my second fish of the night. Half pound bass with a chubby little belly. Yeah, I got him on that Ned Rigged Worm, the Ozark Trail Worm. Let's let him go. Wrestling fans, the Arm Dragon Sensation, second generation superstar LT Falk here, and you're watching Realistic Fishing. And if you want some real fucking advice, keep it realistic. Let's get out of the dark and spooky woods and we'll fish a little bit more along the bank, but it's getting pretty dark. Well, now I need to pretty much feel the bite. It's too dark, I can't see my line anymore. Is that a fish? Fish. There we go, fish number three. Got a quarter pounder with cheese here. Yeah, check him out. Just a little guy. 
third fish of the day though, <laughs> I'm happy to catch anything on a night like tonight. Yeah, little quarter pounder, let's let him go. I came over here to this smaller, more predictable lake. The bite was still pretty tough. I did manage to catch three largemouth bass tonight. I think the largest one was maybe a pound. So if you're out there fishing and you're not getting bites, don't feel bad. It's a weird time right now. Hopefully the fishing improves soon. Thanks for watching Realistic Fishing. Keep it realistic.